Yeah, hey. I want to show you the modifications I made on my backpack. You might be a bit confused as to what is this backpack. It looks somehow familiar. Still, um, there are things that don't match. So this is of course like a combination of things. Uh, we do have I think this is Dutch or British Army side pouches, um, military surplus. Basically everything here is second-hand military surplus uh, minus some some fabric I added. Um, so we have starting. We are starting with the M05 backpack. This is the M05 uh, Finnish Army backpack, um, and I added some stuff to it. And I'm going to show you now what I added. So. Uh, let's start here on the back side um, this very simple hip belt I added some also second hand um, like a kind of um, you know like a molly belt um, and some Dutch army side pouches so let's take off well let's start here so here on top you see um, some, I don't know what is the company, also second-hand military surplus, um, some kind of bigger zipper molly pouch. Um, so I added the, the molly, molly webbing here, four lines, um, which you can see here, and also some velcro to attach a nine patch. So there are four lines of molly on the lid. Um, that's one modification. Next modification, as you can see here, these straps, let's start with the straps. Like, I can already tell you, I, was, I took the whole backpack apart before I could put it together. So I made these straps a lot longer Originally they started here, now they start here on this side. But I'm going to take off this um, <coughs> PLCE rocket pouches. Then you can see more of the mods I did. So that's one rocket pouch off. I don't know if you know them, but they are attached by zippers, so that means you can put, um, you know, skis and stuff still behind it, carry skis on your backpack. Um, I really like them, very simple, very secure attachment system. So, taking the other rocket pouch off, so, and these rocket pouches, this one comes with a, um, you know, like a carrying system, backpack system, so you can make a backpack out of this one, like a day pack, um, and you can even attach both pouches to this backpack system, so have quite a big day pack. So what we are left with, now you can maybe see more, that this is the Savota MO5 Finnish Army backpack, as I said, uh, something I added is like, I made these straps longer, they started here, now they start here, and now there is like a little uh, hooky system, so I can actually detach, detach them from here, but I like to have them run through something, and then I thought I can make it something that you can open. Then obviously, like all these mesh pouches, like, I have two side mesh pouches here on the sides, one and two, uh, M05 mesh, um, and they're both big enough for one Nalgene pocket, um, uh, one Nalgene bottle. Uh, big mesh pouch here on the front, so you can stuff down a tarp or something in here. And then, as you had have seen previously, also these zippers here. Um, PLCE zippers attached, so it's possible to attach these pouches. Um, was that it? I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, nothing else. So, yeah, 
and I, I really like this um, somehow this mixture of um, second hand still like tailor made just exactly how I like it and I like the mesh pouches and also this extra feature of adding these PLCE pouches to it um, very happy with the overall quality I like that it's um, olive green and not camouflage patterned and it's somehow lightweight simple robust so quite probably the best backpack I've had hmm. and yeah for doing this um, it's really good to you know you see like how many layers of fabric there are in here to sew this so you have like in this spot you have the zipper you have two four layers of webbing because it's folded over um, then you have um, two layers of mesh and three layers of cordura so to sew all this um, you need either a very old machine like I have um, or you have also the luck that I also have and uh, my neighbor who has a um, sewing service she lets me use her machine so uh, that makes it all a bit faster than using my old Husqvarna muscle powered one but I could have done the same thing with my repair or with my own machine but load a lot of lot slower so yeah very happy with this um that was all have a good time hey -do. oh have a look at my other videos on this channel there's some good stuff there i think bye bye